My name's Olivia and I'm studying physics at Manchester Uni. Started the process of how to choose my uni by uh, deciding on the course first. So I picked that I wanted to do physics and then basically researched the best places to do this. So Manchester's got a huge physics department, really well known for it. Um, it's got Professor Brian Cox from TV as well, so I quite like that. Um, I did consider kind of going the Oxbridge route, but it just didn't really suit me, to be honest. And then on top of that, I really liked the town of Manchester. It's a really lovely city. There's always loads going on there. Um, the course is quite intense, especially compared to other subjects at Manchester because I think it's slightly more known for its kind of sciences and maths department so a lot of my friends who are doing humanities in their first year for example really didn't have to do a lot of work uh, whereas I did have to do a lot to keep up with the workload but I am glad that in a way because I mean you're paying nine grand a year you kind of you want to get your money's worth but it could be a bit stressful me having uh, about 25 contact hours a week versus my friends who had like five and didn't have to do any homework or anything whereas I was hand constantly handing in sheets, doing lab reports and all that. So I think that is something to consider versus like Oxbridge where everyone is working really hard so you're constantly in that environment which I think does almost make it easier. But I was like, one of the only ones in my group of friends that had to like miss a night out to do my work, which was sometimes a bit annoying. So as sort of already mentioned, I really love the town. I love being in Manchester. There's always so much going on and being from London originally, I kind of needed that big city atmosphere where there's always things to do. The nightlife is really good. There's always good events on. So I really enjoyed first year. I think it does take some getting used to. There are definitely hard parts to it, but I was quite ready to be away from home by the time I was 18. So for me, I didn't get overly homesick or anything. The main thing for me was I came from quite an academic school where they were almost kind of babying you or doing all your work and then going into uni where it's much more independent and you're relied upon to keep up with the work while also trying to make new friends because obviously you've just moved to this completely new place where you don't know anyone. I found that really hard to balance but overall first year is, is really good fun and for most people first year their course doesn't even count so it doesn't matter if you get the balance slightly wrong. My halls were, I was in Owens Park, Tree Court, um, on the Fallowfield campus in Manchester, which was, it was very good fun. I mean, it's a bit, like, it's not amazing, <laughs> it's not luxury, but it, it was fine. It did the job, I didn't mind it at all, and it was very sociable. Um, I did find a bit that with catered halls, it was very good for meeting people at the start, because you'd go down for dinner, sit with whoever you want, and just talk to people. But by the end, I did feel a little bit like I was in boarding school. And I think that environment works for some people. They find their group of mates that go to dinner with. And I had a lot of mates there, but I, I found it a little bit cliquey. So the sport and extracurricular at Manchester is really good. Um, they do kind of, they do this thing called sportisipate, I think it's called, where... Um, people who aren't in the kind of top teams can still do most sports which I think is a really nice thing to do so I do netball at a lower level because I haven't played in years coming into uni so it's nice that you still get to do that sort of thing. Um, I'm also quite involved in the music. I was in the choir for a bit and I get singing lessons at uni. Uh, the only thing I'd say about music is that there's definitely a preference towards people studying music or you kind of have to make friends with the people studying music and like be in that crowd it wasn't that easy for me to find out about all the opportunities because obviously I'm not in the music department most of the time I'm in the physics department 
so that was a bit annoying but Manchester as a city is great for music there's a really great student music scene in Manchester I go to student gigs a lot I know a lot of people in bands I've been brought on to do backing singing and that sort of thing quite a lot um, and it's yeah it's nice but I would say the thing with the music is that you kind of have to go and find it you're not gonna the opportunities don't just come to you really but there's nothing wrong with that I guess it's a good skill um other societies I think a lot well at least my parents told me before I went to uni that you had to join loads of societies as soon as you got there to make friends so I went to the big fair and kind of signed up my name to loads of them but none of my mates seemed to be going to any so I kind of was like oh is that a bit weird um, so I didn't really end up going to many societies in the end so, and I don't think it's a huge thing at Manchester unless you've got like a specific skill like you're really good at a sport or something uh, but at other unis I think that that is more of a thing